the Ukrainian Navy for months, has been hunting the Russian Navy frigate Admiral Makarov. It seems the Ukrainians finally got a shot at the 409-foot, missile-armed vessel in her home port of Sevastopol in Russian-occupied Crimea. The Ukrainian government on Saturday released dramatic videos apparently depicting a successful nighttime strike on Makarov, by at least one unmanned surface vessel. Open-source investigators said the frigate was one of three Russian ships to have been hit. While the Project 266M minesweeper was also struck following the 4.20 a.m. local time raid on Saturday. The speedboat size USV, possibly packing hundreds of pounds of explosives, dodged Russian helicopters and small boats and drove directly at the frigate, approaching to within a few feet before the video feed went dead. There are not yet any photos or videos circulating online that can confirm whether the frigate suffered any damage. Unconfirmed reports said its hull was breached and radar systems smashed. Social media recorded loud explosions in the southern part of Sevastopol, in an area known as Rifleman's Bay. These same unmanned surface vehicle drones are believed to have been involved in the Kerch Bridge explosion in Crimea on October 8. This USV drones are propelled by a single motor with a top speed of 46 miles per hour. They can travel over 60 miles, with a 145 pounds or 65 kilograms payload. Explosive detonators, believed to be attached to the front of the 12-feet canoe-sized vessel, trigger an explosion of what is thought to be an onboard warhead. The drones were among 16 air and maritime robots that launched kamikaze missions on the Russian Navy. The daring robotic raid is history repeating itself. Makarov became the flagship of the depleted Russian Black Sea Fleet in April, after Ukrainian unmanned aerial vehicles and shore-based missile crews worked together to sink the previous flagship, the 612-foot cruiser Moskva, 